in this third part of the video i am sure that once you have watched part number 1 and part number 2 where you have drawn neuron and the ls of kidney your confidence has started growing up if you are not good at drawing so now you have started gaining a confidence that yes you can also draw a good diagram what we have to do is we have to follow okay instructions given properly and once you follow all the instruction pro instructions properly drawing a diagram is not a big deal remember that in the examination your teacher is not going to check or see or concentrate on the beauty of the diagram instead they will see that all the structures are present and all the structures are present properly so now next diagram which we are going to draw is the malphigian body when you look at the malphigian body there is a knot called glomerulus which looks very complicated but believe me it is not at all complicated if you follow all my instructions so here we go with the next diagram diagram number 3 that is drawing a malphigian body first you will draw almost something like a circle then here try to keep a constant gap between two layers so that your diagram looks good this part is called bowman's capsule after drawing bowman's capsule we are about to draw a very important part a blood vessel or a blood capillary with a bigger diameter and when it comes out it is a blood vessel or blood capillary with a smaller diameter you will get zero if size of this blood vessel is not bigger and this this is not smaller now look carefully how i am drawing this complicated part a not like part is called a glomerulus right first we will draw arcs in this direction now we will take these directions now it is looking like a pineapple okay so this part is glomerulus after bowman capsule this part or capillary or blood vessel with a bigger diameter is called efferent arteriole and the other with a smaller diameter is called efferent arteriole this part is called glomerulus please don't forget to put this arrow which indicates the direction of the flow of this fluid it comes inside through efferent arteriole and goes outside through efferent arteriole right to increase the beauty of your diagram what you can do is you can use a pencil of a thick lead there are various pencils available in the market having a lead of a different sizes you can use a thick lead pencil to show the bowman's capsule if you make the outline of the bowman's capsule thick bowman capsule will be prominently visible over here so here we go first and the foremost important part of this malphigian body is bowman's capsule 
then this knot like structure which is called a glomerulus then third part is efferent arteriole and fourth part is efferent arteriole if you don't show the diameter of the efferent arteriole bigger than the diameter of the efferent arteriole you are not going to get any mark then your diagram is zero that's what i said ki beauty of diagram is not important showing all the parts properly is more important so here you have malphigian body in front of you also you are not only asked to draw a diagram but a diagram may be given and parts will be numbered and you have to name these number parts so both the questions are covered over here labeling the diagram as well as drawing the diagram see you all in the next video that is part 4 of this series where we are going to draw the difficult nephron don't miss that video